welcome to my channel I'm Andre and welcome to a tag video today's tag is the most used least used and cutest handbag tag and yes I was reading that wanted to make sure I got it right I was tagged by my very good friend and one of my favorite youtubers Louis Vuitton a coffee lover thank you Tiffany for tagging me I will have Tiffany's channel linked in my description box. Before we get onto the tag, I invite you to subscribe if you're not already subscribed. Whilst you're there, just press the bell to notify you every time I upload a video. And all of that is absolutely free. Cheers to getting something for nothing. Oh, delicious. Okay. Let's get on to the tag. This tag is not as easy as it sounds because, you know, different seasons we have different favourite bags, um, different outings we have different types of bags, therefore they're most used for certain places. Anyway, I'll explain. So, for example, my Biagi bag and this bag, I'll put it out there straight away, was gifted to me and I also have a discount code for this bag which will be linked in my description box. But if you follow me on Instagram, you will know I absolutely use this every day as my gym bag. I sometimes use my Never Full as well, but I mostly use this bag because when I do blaze, it's they're really quite strict on taking bags into the blaze studio so it has to be a very small bag that's just going to carry your necessities so my necessities for a blaze class are basically my boxing gloves my heart monitor which i'm usually wearing and another pair of gloves which are kind of gloves that I wear inside my boxing gloves something to wipe away all that sweat after hard work I always I have problem knees you know years of working out I'm not going to put it down to age it is years of working out so I always have to kind of have some sort of support for my knee just in case and um, I normally carry a solution for my contact lenses as well it's not in there but um yeah and some sort of kind of moisturizing cream and that's just the other part of my heart monitor which clips onto my belt which I normally wear so that is my most used everyday bag for the gym now in the summer it turned out that my most used bag was my YSL bag I took it on holiday I was wearing lighter colors it was a new bag so this during the summer months and really autumn and even up to now has been my most used bag more recently and it tends to be the bag I use the most during winter is my jumbo just here and it's actually the bag I'm using right now and you can see I've got everything in the bag as well so this is probably you know I'm not gonna use this bag as a going out bag you know I'm not gonna use that bag for just going out to dinner going out shopping I have done but it tends to be now more my gym bag so this is the bag I kind of go for for a more kind of everyday basis so when I was working my most used bag was my Prada bag just here with my never full which is sitting up there we all know what a never full looks like so <laughs> I bet you didn't think you know that's what I mean by you know you we use different bags I'm just going to tidy things up for kind of different occasions and that's you know a most used bag can work for many different types of things am i making any sense probably not but you know what i'm talking about so that's the most used bag category what was the next one least used it's going to get even more confusing now because least used bag right i have on the bottom shelf here i have a lot of old gucci bags which honestly and truthfully i don't use anymore if I sold them, they probably wouldn't be there. But you know, they're bags that when I had at the time, I used a lot and I don't use them anymore. But actually I thought, no, Andre, think about this 
right? These bags were used when they were kind of of the time. So actually, I looked around and I thought, this was a birthday present and it's a furler bag and I'm lucky if I've used it once. But I have one that I haven't even used at all and I'll just get it. And it's this little bag here and this was a Zara bag and it's absolutely beautiful and I don't regret getting it and I will use it, it's just the opportunity hasn't arisen for me to use the bag because it's absolutely a beautiful bag. So it's this pearl, you know, when you love bags, you just love bags and I just, I think this is just a beautiful bag. So I haven't used this, so I think this wins over the rest as the least used bag because the others, although I don't use them anymore, I was going to say my Michael Kors, but actually I have used my clear Michael Kors bag and this is going to be the easiest easiest one so the next one is the cutest bag and i really didn't have to think about that because i think this is the cutest bag i think the lady dior is just the most beautiful bag and i've said before as well this is my husband's favorite bag as well he thinks this is the nicest bag i absolutely just love this bag actually when you look at the style of the two, I know this is supposed to represent a Birkin, but actually, you know, it's that kind of top handle with the long straps. Um, both have their problems getting in and out of, you know, that type of thing. This is, of course, in lambskin. I just think this is one of the most beautiful, beautiful bags. I love the structured handles of this bag. I really, really do. I mean. I just think it's a beautiful, beautiful bag. I love the jingle that it makes. I just love every, I love the puffiness, everything. This bag, I absolutely love, you know, to bits. I just love the whole look of that bag. On that note, I think I need to have a little sip. So that's the uh, most used, least used and cutest bag tag done. So I can tick that off. So if you haven't done the tag, I am tagging you to do it. I will. So on that note, cheers. Thank you very much for watching and I'll catch you next time. Bye. Oh, oh. and if you fancy watching more videos from me, I will link one here, here. And if you're not already subscribed, I'm going to put the A right here. Cheers. <laughs>